She's got a nice ass. Five, four, three, two, one. Hey people, it's Monday. I do anything else on this video, I have two birthday announcements. One is my friend Alice, who is 18 on Wednesday, and one is my friend Heather, who was 18 last Wednesday, and had an awesome party where we all dressed up as things beginning with the letter H. The theme this week is inspired by NaNoWriMo, which all the members of IL5 are signed up on. Um, pretty much in the last three videos everyone spoke about NaNoWriMo, so I'm not going to talk about it. All I will say is that, like just about everything else, my username is hellohanna 5 so if you want to go add me as a writing buddy, and then we can like totally write together. I don't know what my novel's going to be about yet. I have not even planned it at all, and I have like 10 days. On to the theme! This week's theme is an epic story. I'm going to begin the story and then throughout the rest of the week the other girls will fill in their instalments of the story. Um, it's going to be pretty random and it's going to be pretty epic. There were four girls and none of them were vampires. Now I know what you're thinking, a story without vampires? Who ever heard of such a thing? Well, tis true, tis true. Their names were Hannah, Jackie, Marissa and Leah, and this is their epic story. Twas the night before New Moon, and the girls were staying in a small, sleepy town named Forks, Washington. They were there for the premiere showing of New Moon, the movie, and they were all incredibly excited. Just as they began to fall asleep, they heard a noise. It was the noise of a ballet shoe. Jackie switched on the light, and there, dressed in the frilliest tutu known to man, was Robert Panson. The girls gasped. Robert gasped. Even the carpet gasped. Robert, what are you doing? asked Hannah. Rob looked ashamed, trying desperately to hide his Hello Kitty tights. Okay, okay, he said. I love to dance. It's my life. The acting is a mere facade. What gets me up in the morning is not lines and scripts and premieres. It's plies and arabesques and point work. But Rob, how come you've never spoken of your secret passion for ballet? Asked Marissa. Are you crazy? He asked. I'm an international star. I would be ruined. I have to secretly practice my art in hotel rooms and small cafes. Maybe we can help you, suggested Leah. You can? He asked. Of course, she replied. We have over 700 subscribers. We'll work out a plan. Thank you, the actor slash ballet dancer answered. I'll meet you at La Push tomorrow night at midnight. Like my good friend Eric once said, it's La Push. We'll see you there, Jackie told him. Until then, my fangirls, I bid you adieu. He swept out of the room and Team IL5 put on their thinking hats. Literally, Marissa made them one day. Okay guys, we'll meet Rob tomorrow night at La Push because, well, it's La Push. We need to think of a plan. Dun dun dun! To be continued. A word about themes on IL5. If you have any ideas for themes, no matter how wacky or crazy they are, please leave them in the comments because um, we're always looking for new ideas for themes and obviously we want to do the themes that you want to see. So if you have an idea for a theme, just whack it down there. Or a question, you know, any, you know, use that comment box. Go, go crazy. 